My name is David Hill. I'm the director of Outreach and producer, uh, artistic director for Night of Festivals. This is a special Night of Festivals London event, which uh, is here for the opening weekend of the Rio Olympics. So our aspiration was very much to have a fusion between Brazilian, Latin American artists and art forms that would celebrate uh, the opening of the Rio Olympics, but also celebrate as well our European collaborations, which have been a really important part of the development of Night of Festivals. So we have German, Bulgarian, Romanian artists here taking part as visual artists, performing artists, theatre artists. My name is Georgi Balabanov. I am from Bulgaria and uh, I am very glad that, that I have this possibility to, to show some of my artworks. I am here uh, to show this installation of art, uh, art installation with uh, two big suitcases. My name is uh, Golden Green, that's a pseudonym. So my writer's name, uh, my installation actually don't got a name. It's untitled, yes. But the theme is like freedom. I do graffiti like for 25 years and I don't know if I would call this like installation. I mean, it looks a little bit like an installation, but yeah. Um, so yeah, I do it like for 25 years. There were two particular highlights for me. One was the performance by Masca Theatre from Bucharest in Romania. This is the first ever visit of that company to the UK and their living statues were absolutely stunning. Beautifully performed, exquisitely choreographed and something very different for British audiences and visitors of course to see. I am Mihai Malai Mare and I am the director of uh, Masca Theatre from Bucharest, Romania. We are invited here to, to, to make some uh, living statue and to present now uh, a performance realized in living statue style, The Wall. I like, I like it because, because uh, we can meet each, uh, each other actors and because we, we can see uh, each other others, it's, it's uh, a very, a very uh, nice uh, and theatrical uh, moment. I think uh, it's been very interesting to see the development over the last nine months of the European collaborations that have been involved in Night of Festivals London. So this is the culmination of, a, of our freedom strand of work within Night of Festivals, which includes the Nighttime Carnival, the Plinth Project and Freedom Wall. And they've all evolved and developed over that time. So the Nighttime Carnival, this was its fourth and final outing. And it was very tight, very refined, and has come on beautifully over the last few months. My name is Tom Lansky, I'm from Hamburg, from Germany. And I'm here together with uh, Artreach. And tonight we are doing in, in uh, one of the part of a European project we're doing together, the name is Freedom. We are doing a big freedom parade and afterwards a 20 minutes show about freedom. The, the parade is from uh, three uh, theatre groups. Two are from Germany and so one is from uh, England, from London. It's Stelzenart, Oak Leaf and uh, Mandinga Arts. I'm Bettina Eichblatt and uh, I'm uh, yeah, Oak Leaf Stelzenkunst. So Eichblatt means Oak Leaf, so the name is easy. <laughs> and uh, yeah, I'm here with, with my still performance group and we joined in the, the big European exchange program for this night of festivals, for the, this democracy and freedom project. And yeah, we work together with the others quite for a while now, and this is the finish of it, and we're really looking forward to it. I'm Janine Jägi. I'm from Switzerland, but I live in Germany, and I'm from the group Stelzen Art from Bremen, Germany. We work for a long time in this inflatable costumes with the light in. It's not really, it's not really easy work, and we try out really in a good way. So it's really light and uh, big costumes in good shape. So yeah, we try hard to do this. Okay, my name's Bryony. Um, I'm a stilt walker in the parade. 
Um, so we're going to be doing a festival, a light festival, because our costumes light up. There's such a fusion of different uh, nationalities in this company. What's been fantastic is first of all it's been dry, it's been sunny which has obviously brought out the crowds as well as the advanced publicity for the event. Um, fantastic numbers here yesterday, it was absolutely packed on Potter's Field and around the Scoop and Queen's Walk and I think the sense we had was that people were loving the variety of work that was happening, they were stimulated by it I think, very entertained, we saw lots of very diverse audiences around all generations. I'm Charles Beecham and I'm Joint Artistic Director with Julieta Rubio of Mandinga Arts and we've been invited by Artreach to collaborate artistically in the spirit of Night of Festivals here on the South Bank. We specialise as visual artists mainly, we create puppets and design costumes, headdresses and props and then um, invite dancers and members of the community, and puppeteers, amateurs, children, adults, to bring life to these costumes. My name is uh, Julieta Rubio. I am from Colombia. I am an artist of Mandinga Arts. I design costumes and make costumes with Charles. Today has been very special. The day is fantastic. The weather is helping people to, to be so warm and happy. Lovely, and the German people here, they are very good friends of us, and they are out of this world. <laughs> I'm Elsa Perez, and I'm working with Mandinga Carnival Arts. I've worked with them for many, many years, and I usually do a choreography for them. And today we did a mix of samba, merengue, uh, Colombian, you know, just a whole mix of Latino rhythms. Seeing the, the people along the side, their enjoyment, and going to play with them, getting them to dance or whatever. My name is Ahik. Um, I'm president of the Paraiso School of Samba. Today is a great day for us to be here because Samba is a community and celebrate of folklore and art and folklore of a people, okay? It's all about the habits and the costumes people create throughout the days and became uh, a, a customized things they do every day. It's a family event for it started and it does bring a, a health size of every person, human being coming here and being a beautiful day, appreciate music, dance. The simple things in life it is sometimes just there for free for you just to enjoy it. You just to know how to appreciate it and be happy, you know. My name is Natalia Santana Revi, yeah. and I'm the development uh, director of the group Maracatu Estrela do Norte. And we came to he here today to perform. We are showing the culture of the state of Pernambuco in the northeast of Brazil. So we have uh, a culture with integrated with African uh, movements, African uh, culture as well. So it's a, it's a celebration of Africa and Brazil together. I think it's very important to spread uh, our culture, also to share a little bit of uh, different style of music and dance from Brazil so that people can understand that we are, you go beyond the samba, we also have maracatu, which is the uh, rhythm that we play today and something wonderful that we, we love sharing uh, amongst this crowd that is so international here today. In a day and age when people perhaps have less money to spend and when um, Barriers are breaking down between art forms and when traditional venues are perhaps not as popular or not reaching wider audiences, having big, free access, high quality outdoor arts festivals is really important. And 
you know, we, we aspire always for quality in what we do, as well as for making sure that we are genuinely creating access for the whole community. So absolutely vital. We are dependent on the funding we get, of course, which is for this is from the Arts Council of England and from European Union through Creative Europe. Those are two important sources and we know with Brexit that the European sources may not be as um, easy to access in the future. Uh, but um, I think you can tell by the reaction of crowds and the numbers here just how important the festival is.